Hi everyone, welcome to my channel ICT Active Learners. Today I am here to explain Cambridge IGCSE ICT 2023 May June Paper 21 Document Production Part. So, before I start, I have to check that I have been supplied with these files. So, I have the files here at my desktop. Starting with task 1, which is our evidence document. So, open the file J2321 evidence and make sure that your name, center number, candidate number will appear on every page. So, we will open the evidence document and we will insert as a header or a footer our name then our center number and then our candidate number that's all and then we need to save this document as evidence and then our candidate number so file save as I will just simply save it on the desktop as a word document with the name evidence okay evidence and my candidate number is 0297 next step is to start with task 2 you are going to edit a document for the Tawara Cycling Festival. The company uses a corporate house style for all their documents. Paragraph styles must be created and applied as instructed. So using a suitable software package, open the file j2321festival.rtf. So that's the file. The page setup is set to A4, portrait orientation with 2 cm margins. Do not make any changes to these settings. So let's cross check if the setting is accordingly or not. So layout, page setup. So the page orientation is portrait, all the margins 2 cm and page size is A4. So we do not change, make any changes here. Three paragraph styles have already been created. So if you have a look here, home, three paragraph styles are already created. CF body, CF sub and CF table. So do not make any changes to these unless instructed and save the document in your work area with the name festival. So you just need to save it with the name festival. So I will save it in the word document format with the name festival. Next step is to make sure that it is saved in the format of the software you are using like I have saved it as a word document. Place in your evidence document a screenshot to show this file has been saved so i will go to the folder and i will increase this area to show the file type festival and then a screenshot just to show that you have saved this file this is going to be your evidence one now moving to the next step place in the header of the festival document your name center number and candidate number right align so we'll go there insert in the header on the right side your name then center number and then your candidate number on the right side and then place in the footer automatic page number left line then you can even insert a footer and then on the left side we should include automated page number so we just click here in current position and then the page number 
you don't need any other placeholders so we will delete them as we don't require them close and then step number three create and store the following style basing it on default normal paragraph style so we need to create the style with the name cf title so i will just move to the end of the document so my rest of the data will never disturb with it create a style name the style modify style based on normal style for the following paragraph and it should be uh, you just simply select from here even normal or default okay so that is how you have to go and then it mentioned here it should be a serif font and 32 point so serif the best example for the serif is times new roman and the font size as they mentioned 32 you just simply type here 32 and then it should be center align then it should be bold and italic so we'll make it bold italic and then after it should be single line spacing so format paragraph line spacing is single before spacing is 0 and after spacing is 9 so after spacing is 9 you click on ok and then click on ok a style is created and then what we need to do we need to take a screenshot to show that you have defined all the settings for this style right click modify take a screenshot of it just crop it and this should be your evidence too for step 3 then make sure the evidence is based on the default and normal paragraph it is and then place it into your evidence document now apply the cf title style to the text tawara cycling festival so we will go to the top we select this one and we apply the style then change the page layout so that the subheading the trails and the following text up to and including the paragraph ending their equipment is saved is displayed in two columns of equal width with a 1.5 centimeter space between them so starting from the trails till the end their equipment is safe layout column more column change it to 2 and spacing between them is 1.5 this is how it will look like next step you need to import the image j2321 rider and place it in the paragraph beginning all trail start and finish so we will just get an image all trail start and finish with the paragraph here and we'll insert an image from desktop from our folder j2321 riders picture is included then reflect the image so that the bike point to the left so we need to reflect the image so simple right click format picture 3d rotation and 180 degrees pointing to the left and then after format the image so that it is resized to 4 cm width and the spec ratio is maintained so click here format the width is going to be 4 cm and the aspect ratio is maintained and it is aligned to the left column margin and the top of the paragraph start with the sentence all trail starts and finish so it should be on the left side so you just simply click here text wrap square and now try to move it around yeah 
as you can see the green lines it means that it is left aligned to the top of this paragraph and definitely the test scrap should be there around the picture next is apply bullet to the text from bike handling for children for till yoga for cyclist so the bullets are intended 1.5 cm you can select any bullets by the way so we'll just select these bullet points here from here till this point and we will apply to it a bullet for example this one and then it should be intended 1.5 cm from the left so right click paragraph indentation is going to be 1.5 done and then after the list is in a single line spacing no spacing before and after so right click paragraph there is no spacing before and after but there is a six point space after the last item so just click here right click paragraph and after spacing is six that's all locate the table in the document delete the entire column and content with the heading lunch so first of all try to find the table in the document so as i can see that's the table what i will do first i will get the borders around then i will remove the column with the lunch including the data select and delete the column got deleted then after format the left column of the table so that it look like the left column of this table like this so what we need to do select these all and then right click merge cells and then the text direction we need to uh, change the text direction so we have the options just like that and then it should be in the center then the background or we need to fill this cell with a color and we will fill it with the color black the text will move to the white automatically and then we need to adjust this column or we can move it from here so it fits the width of the table then after all when it is done look at this it should not happen so we just move yeah so now our text is fine and this one is also climb feet should be properly yes just like that and then after we need to adjust the width of this one so it will look like that and we'll move forward to the next step as i mentioned we need to apply cf table style to column 2 3 and 4 of the table only so column 2 3 and 4 so we select this one and we apply the table style to it so it will look like this make sure that all the text of the each row display in one line so it is displayed in one line one point black internal and external grid line are displayed so just click here go to borders and shading so the grid line is one point uh, one and a half right now so we will change it to a point okay a point so it's like that now and then after the table border should fit in the fit in the width of the column it is and then there's a six point space after the table so means we can just click here and include the paragraph 
before six. So there is a six point gap between the table and the paragraph. Moving to the next point, look at the text star new in the table and format it to be a superscripted text. So we simply select this one and click on the option called superscript just like that. Spell check and proofread the document. Make sure that the list and the table are not split over the two column or pages. So our table is in one column. Our list is in one column. And then there is no widow and orphan. There is no blank page. So there is nothing. And then after all the styles are applied. And just we need to save the document. And we need to print this document. And that's it from the document production part of this question paper so we just need to print this is how it's going to be so that's all from the document production part of this question paper hope you have learned about how to use the microsoft word word processor to get to the normal and proper formatting of the document thanks for watching Please subscribe the channel for more videos and updates.